climate change adaptation and agribusiness support program is to establish 300 hectares of grazing reserve across Casino State. These, according to the Minister of Agriculture, Aldo Ogbe, would assist in preventing farmers' headers conflict in the state. Also, as part of effort towards reducing poverty and to increase food security, the program has rehabilitated a 2.5 kilometer rural feeder road. Correspondent Casina, uh, uh, Correspondent Casina State, Awal Ibrahim, has details. 22 rural feeder roads are undergoing rehabilitation across some seven states. 243 new rural roads will also be constructed, cutting across Katsuna, Jigawa, Zamfara, Sokwatu, Kebbi, and Yobe State. And this, according to the Agriculture Minister, will benefit many farming communities. The Federal Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development, through the CAPS program, is intervening in the provision of 997 solar-powered boreholes, which will be benefiting at least half a million vulnerable women and men. The state project coordinator of the Climate Change Adaptation and Agribusiness Support Program stated that grasses would be produced on 50 hectares of land to serve as communal grazing reserve. This five hectares is seed farm center where we are able to produce the seeds that will be used in planting other areas. We now want to have a pilot of five, 50 hectares. It is out of that 50 hectares that we take these five hectares to do this uh, seed, uh, seed production farm area. When we produce, we are going to produce about uh, five uh, varieties, Chloris and Bafagun Gayanus, Stylus and uh, Lab Lab. So those are the grades that we are going to produce here. Members of the benefiting communities expressed appreciation to the climate change adaptation and agribusiness support program for the feeder road and the ranch land. We are farmers and we are cattle rearers. Once our cattle were have been getting enough food, so it means that will, it will at least it will double our economic, uh, economic resources because this cattle is it's our economic, it's through this cattle we have done many things with them. Inshallah, we will try our best so that we will deploy the volunteers so that all these grasses that have been, uh, uh, all these grasses that is to be uh, planted, the, it will be protected because it will be, uh, because it will benefit our animals. The Sukwanawa Ed Dam in Dora local government area is undergoing rehabilitation work to serve as a water drinking point for animals. Awal Ibrahim, TVC News, Katsana.